Hello and welcome to my channel. My name is Shenzi and today I'm going to be filming a get ready with me and also a get to know me. So the first thing I'm going to do is just wash my face and I just use um, this Dr. Bronner's Castile Soap, just the unscented baby one, and then moisturize with this CeraVe moisturizing cream. Um, and that's my skincare routine, that's all I do. Just dry my face with a towel. All right, so my name is Shenzi. I am 21 years old from the Portland, Oregon area, and I am all of a new mom. I um, gave birth to my son, Crew, about six months ago. He's gonna be six months and five days, which is insane. It's literally so crazy. I don't know if you can see, but I'm gonna take this Laneige, um, what is this, lip treatment balm. And I'm just gonna moisturize my lips before I start my makeup. So yeah, my son is almost six months old, which is so insane. Time just flies. It's so wild. I live with my boyfriend, Nick. We've been dating since my sophomore year of high school. Um, so five years. And yeah. I'm priming my, this area with this Ramel London Stay Matte Primer. Um, it's dirty and it's almost out, but it works really good. My boyfriend and I are planning to move to Tampa, Florida in October with my best friend Grace. We've been friends since our whole lives and um, when my grandparents bought their house, her dad moved in, I believe shortly after, right next door. Like our backyards were touching or my grandparents' backyard and her backyards were touching um, and yeah. We met then and we've just been friends ever since. Oh, by the way, I'm taking this NYX Micro Brow Pencil in the shade Espresso on my eyebrows. You can see me balancing on the wall, that's so embarrassing, but I, I need to do this. I'm just doing like a real quick makeup for the day. I'm just doing like light eyebrows. I'm gonna do some concealer, bronzer, and blush, and then some mascara, so nothing crazy. Um, but yeah also nick and i we have two dogs and a cat we have a french bulldog his name is money he's three and we have a little shih tzu her name is lilo and she's also three and then our cat meow we call her meow but her name is coco um she's just like a brown tabby cat or yeah she's brown um she is gonna be two this year i think I don't know. I'm really excited to start YouTube. I've always wanted to do this um, for as long as I can remember, honestly. But I just never really, I don't know. I never really actually started. I posted YouTube videos here and there when I was younger, um, but I was just always worried about like kids at school like bullying me or making fun of me. And they did for the videos that I, well, they didn't bully me, but like people would talk about them at school and I would get so embarrassed. Um, so that's honestly the reason why I never like actually started, but I've always wanted to do this, like always. Yeah, I was just always embarrassed of doing it. And then after I graduated, I graduated in 2020. So it was like a thing to be an influencer. And even now, like it's like a thing, um, like everyone's trying to be a YouTuber or be a TikToker. Oh, by the way, I'm using the NARS concealer in macadamia, um, just like in my T-zone. But yeah, so after I graduated, I was like, oh, like this is honestly like a perfect time to do it. But now I don't want to seem like I'm like chasing fame, you know, because like I really always wanted to do this, but now I don't want to just seem like I'm like following trends, you know? 
And so that discouraged me from doing it for a while. But now I'm like, no, I'm just going to do it. And I'm just going to be myself. And like, I'm not here to be aesthetic and perfect. And, you know, I'm not trying to be someone I'm not. I'm just here to like document and share my life and, you know, how it is being a young mom. And yeah, I'm really excited. This is just always what I wanted to do. So I'm really excited to be able to share my life and just like our adventures navigating through life as young parents. And we're about to move across the country. So that's gonna be really exciting to document, but it'll be fun to look back on when my kids are older. Like, I don't know, they'll be able to see things that they, you know, don't remember because Kurt was really young right now. So he's not gonna remember moving across the country, but it'll be documented so he'll be able to look back on it. So I just blended out all the concealer in my T-zone and then I'm gonna take this. This is super old. It's Revolution, Makeup Revolution Luxury Baking Powder in Banana. I don't know if they still sell this, but I got it from my lash lady. It was like cleaning out her makeup because she was moving to Hawaii when I got my lashes done. And she was like, yeah, you can take anything you want. And this is one of the things I took. And I just got this brush from Target. It's just an e.l.f. multi-use face brush. I'm going to use it for the powder. I just, I just dust it on. I'm not, I'm not a makeup artist. I just am a person who wears makeup. I just wanted to get on here and film like a get to know me video um, for my first video, like introducing myself so that you guys know what I'm about. Um, but yeah, I'm not trying to be too serious or be too formal. My videos aren't going to be perfect and they're not going to be like, you know, perfectly edited and curated. Like this is just real life. This is basically like my reality show, if you will. <laughs> But yeah, I'm really excited and it's going to be fun. I am taking this ancient Morphe palette. There's like, there's nothing on the back. Like I couldn't even tell you what it is if I tried. Um, but I'm going to use, I can't even read what the color is called. This, this one right here. I'm bronzing, but in the areas where you contour. You know, that makes sense. I love to watch like lifestyle vlogs and just vlogs in general um so that's the type of content I'm going to create I'm just going to create what I like to watch I don't really do much I don't really you know go out much I go grocery shopping and go to Target and like you know nothing crazy we don't live in Portland we live like in a suburb of Portland so it's not like it's booming out here it's just a little suburb but yeah, just lifestyle stuff like clean my house with me or, you know, stuff like that. I just love watching vlogs in everyday life. Again, it's not going to be super, you know, super perfect looking and I'm not going to look perfect all the time. Or I'm never going to look perfect. I should say that. I'm never going to look perfect. Sorry, the fan just turned on. It's an, it's an auto fan, so I can't just turn it off. But hopefully you guys can hear me. I'm gonna take this Clinique blush. It is my favorite blush of all time. It's in Ginger Pop, sorry. It is gorgeous. It's cracked because I dropped it, but it's so cute. But yeah, it's like, I don't get dressed every day. I don't hardly do my makeup. Um, and when I leave the house, I leave the house in sweats. Like, I'm not trying to impress anyone, you know? And then sometimes what I do to just like blend everything together is I just take a brush and I just kind of blend my stuff out. And then for my lashes, I just use this Shishido eye curler or eyelash curler. And then my mascara is the Bad Gal Bang Waterproof Mascara by Benefit. And this combo, like I have really short non-existent eyelashes, but this combo so far, has been my favorite this lash curler though like is a game changer it is expensive but it is a game changer um i looked at like a million reviews before i bought it and i was skeptical and i was like Ugh, i hope this isn't a waste of money but it really does 
curl your lashes, guys. I'm trying to decide if I want to like do my hair or if I just want to leave it up in a bun. I literally spend forever curling my lashes. Like they have to be up. Okay, so this is with one coat, and yes, I have short eyelashes. Like, there's nothing I can do about it. But the lash curler makes them like stand up so you can actually see that I have eyelashes. All right, so my makeup is done, and I've decided I'm just gonna leave my hair in this bun. Um, my hair is naturally really curly, but it's straightened right now. Well, kind of. I straightened it, and then last night I slept on it just down, and I sweat, and so now it's like super curly and wild. Um, so I'm just gonna leave it up in this bun. All I have to do today is go to the chiropractor and he's not gonna care. So yeah, thank you for getting to know me and watching my get ready with me. Be sure to comment down below. Let me know what you guys wanna see in the future and be sure to like and subscribe. Bye.